Hi, Mal here, just checking in. Uh, quick little post, little Facebook Live for you. Um, I was doing an interview today, and I was talking to a fascinating woman who had gone through incredible challenges as a child. And, you know, that's when we're most impressionable, is when we're little. So the things that people tell us or how they treat us ultimately creates behaviors when we grow up. And some of those behaviors become limitations. And that's what I wanted to talk about. Do you really have any limitations in this life or can you do anything you really want to do? And the answer is you can. If you think you can't, then guess what? You're absolutely right because your belief system is telling you that you can't. But what if you change that mindset to the fact that you are unlimited and you can do whatever you want? When you were born and you first got on this planet, you were perfect. You didn't have any limitations. There wasn't anything wrong with you. You didn't think there was anything wrong with you. You didn't even know how to even have a concept that there would be anything wrong with you. That's a clean slate. And that's how you get rid of limitations, is getting back to that mindset of having a clean slate. So where does all the feedback, the negative feedback come in that ultimately causes your limitations. Well, I introduced you to somebody a couple of weeks ago, two weeks ago, and she's going to come back on tonight, and it's Louise. Louise creates limitations. Louise is the voice of the ego. Louise is that conditioned mindset that has been listening to all that negative feedback over the years and now is telling you loud and clear that you can't do something. That's Louise. She has taken on all the negative aspects of judgment, criticism, lack of belief in yourself. That's what the ego voice does. And she is so proud of herself. She is so proficient at knocking you down and having you believe that you can't do something. Well, it's not true. All you have to know how to do is talk to Louise. All you have to know how to do is say, wait a minute. There's another voice in this head that is my higher self that really is guiding me. You're my lower self. You're my ego voice. You're the voice of judgment that has picked up all that criticism from other people and things, and now you're planting it in my mind. Well, I'm not going to let that limit me. I'm not going to let that stop me from creating the life I want. That's how simple all of this is. Once you know that Louise exists and she's in there chatting away and you can identify that voice, that voice of limitation, of block, of fear, of anger, judgment, resentment, whatever you want to call it, that's Louise. But she is part of you, so you can't just kill her off. You have to work with her. You have to understand she's there and then talk back to her and say, wait a minute, you're not going to run the show. I know you're there. I know you really want to kind of keep me safe and protect me and make sure that, you know, I don't do something stupid like trying to fly and I can't. So I realize that you're creating limitations to keep me safe. And bless her for that. You know, she's trying to keep you in one piece. But the fact of the matter is, She's the one that creates limitations. So if you recognize that and silence the little voice very nicely and say, thank you for your input, but I'm not going to listen to that and I'm not going to live my life based on what you're telling me. I'm going to do 
what I know I can do, what I believe in myself that I'm capable of doing, then guess what? No more limitations. Now you get to live the life you really want to live. And you can work with Louise. You can have a cooperating relationship with Louise. So that's this week's little tip from the Sacred Circle of Soul Connection. And live smart, love smart. We love you. And I'm even beginning to love Louise because I understand her and I know what her antics are and when she's going to show up and when she's going to try to hold me back and the things that she says to me. So now I've, I've got a pretty good working relationship with her and um, getting a lot more great stuff done, like going sugar-free, gluten-free, and dairy-free all at once. That's not easy, and we're doing it. I may be ready to chew the bark off a tree, but we're doing it. Have a great night, and I love you all. Bye. Louise, bye.